To begin the subquest, inspect by repeat in the banquet. After that conversation, head to the previous room and speak to the cook. Chat options on screen. Before we proceed, go ahead and dismiss any familiars you might have. Next, head to the Ports of Rim dock. Speak to an NPC called Murphy. Choose the first chat option. Speak to him again and choose the first, then the second chat option. Go ahead and equip the fishbowl helmet and the diving apparatus he gives you. Now before you proceed, make sure you weigh under 27 kilograms. If you need to deposit a few things, there's a bank chest nearby or a deposit box. Once you're ready, speak to Murphy and choose the first chat option for both prompts. Now that you're underwater, head north and pick up a few pieces of kelp. I only picked up three, but if you have a low cooking level, you might want to pick up a few extra. Keep heading north and speak to an NPC called Nung. Then head west to find a mudskipper cave. Pick up a few rocks nearby and attempt to enter the cave. You'll know if you're heavy enough once you go through. Kill the mudskippers till you obtain 5 hides. Then speak to Nung once again. Then speak to Nung once again. You'll now be able to enter the crab pen.
go ahead and slay a few crabs and of course I recommend killing a few extra in case you burn your food and you'll have to come all the way back. Now with your crab meat and kelp in your inventory, you are free to leave. I recommend going to Lumbridge as you need to go there anyway. Now before you do anything, do not cook the crab meat. You will have to follow a specific instructions very carefully. The instructions to everything you need to do is on screen right now. Go ahead and right click your kelp, crab meat and raw cod. There will be a grind option on all of them. Do the same with the bread, but in case you get a prompt that says nothing interesting happens, you'll have to go ahead and speak to the cook. You might have missed the dialogue from before, but if it does slice, then we could just proceed. Speak to the cook and choose a third chat option. Go ahead and use the ingredients on each other and you will receive a raw fish cake. Now hopefully it didn't burn. If it did, that's why I recommended to pick up some extra kelp and crab meat. Now just be careful. The left click option on the fish cake is eat. With that out of the way, go ahead and use the fish cake on pie repeat. And subquest complete. 